Hey, welcome back, guys, to another episode of Scott Pilgrim vs. the World. I am... I'm feeling daring. I'm going to do two videos, recordings in a single day. I'm going to try to beat level two. I haven't been able to beat level two yet, and I think it's because I didn't have that bionic arm upgrade, but I'm feeling really confident with my Ramona right now, so let's do this thing. Oh, no, no, no. These guys suck. Like, the... Like, the freeze damage when they take your picture is, like, so pronounced. Get out of here. You wanna make sure that you don't get sandwiched by them by accident. I think the only way to, like, really get rid of them... Ooh, what happens when you do this move? When I hit them both at the same time? What does that do? I don't know what that does. I'm gonna find out. Ooh, what's in the chip wagon? Let's find out. French fries, poutine, European hot dog, buffalo burger, and a coke one. I don't know what that is. Is that a ham sandwich? That is a hot ham sandwich. Okay. Poutine is delicious, by the way. If you guys don't know what poutine is, it's amazing. So, mm, here we go. Okay, and I think this is the film set, so I'm about to get into a battle here because I have played this level before, and I'm trying not to die. These guys are really difficult, so don't let these guys drop this and then these like crazy looking they do that <laughs> they hurt so much 11 damage with like knockback and recoil and then the other guys hit you with a laser and that also does fire damage so yeah i feel a lot better now that i have ramona leveled up a little bit i feel like i can actually take on this level right now so normally these guys like almost knock me out And then don't let these guys do chip damage on you. They're gonna run around, and they only do like one damage. Like it takes one hit to knock them out, but basically like, they're the people on the green screen trying to hide, so. <laughs> I'm gonna take my coins. I don't know why some why they have a peep on there. I think that's a marshmallow peep. And then I'm pretty sure that I need to break this forehead. Oh, dang. That was fast. Yeah, I've never been able to do that that specifically before. That's amazing. This bionic arm upgrade is pretty much the best thing that I've been able to get in this game so far. Oh, no! Get out of here. Mm. Wow, I can't reach him? No! So clumsy. Get out. I'll hit you with the rock. And then there is a key, which I'm totally going to take and try not to drop into the pit of lava. I mean, is that real lava? Holy crap. Here we go. Gets me into the next part of this level. Oh, wow. <laughs> Indiana Jones here. Running. Okay. Whoa. So that could have ended horribly. I could have got hit by the bowling ball and fell into the lava in one go. I'm gonna keep this rock on me in case I need to throw it at someone. Oh, perfect. Yeah, get out of here, bat. Oh, I wanted that coin, though. Oh, no, no, I need that. Take this. I'm gonna carry this over with me. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't mean to do that. Mm. Oh, it actually went through the door? That's pretty nice. No, there's actually a level... Um, there's actually a trap with the key later on in this level, so I thought I opened up the trap by accident, and then it basically like up, opens up a deadly wall of spikes that moves towards you, so you want to do that as the very last thing in that room. That is the thing that you don't want to open immediately. He's trying to bait you, so I made that mistake. Like, I only made it one time, but I didn't have the damage to break the treasure chest in time and get myself out of here. I needed to break that Tiki Man, I didn't have the strength for it. So I lost a life, basically, so it was not worth the coins that were in that treasure chest. Ow. Okay, so, save this coin, or save this key. Don't open the treasure chest until the very end, but do break this guy. And then go ahead and open this afterwards. And then this will release, um... 
a bunch of $2 coins, which you do want to pick up, but then you can see this wall is going to approach you, and if you get trapped, you're going to die, so you might be able to break that Tiki Man before you open up that treasure chest. That's my only recommendation for you guys, if you guys are using this as a walkthrough. So. I'm feeling pretty good with this rock in my hand right now. Okay, cannot damage that guy. I'm going to avoid the people that run across. Ow! Oh, I, I did 25 damage to myself with the rock. That was crazy. Okay, got one guy down. One more guy. Here we go. Oh, nice. Can I pick up that? That star you? Yeah. Get this guy out of the way. Get these guys out of the way. I feel like a professional right now. I feel like I'm actually playing this game well. <laughs> Get this bat. Come on, I'm ready. I'm ready. Who am I fighting? Who do I got here? Is there any food back here? Oh no, what's happening? Oh jeez. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, come on. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I think the car explodes if you don't break it in time, so that causes a lot of damage on screen, so I was like, I am not going to be defeated <laughs> by a bunch of paparazzi. Oh, what's happening here? I got to Lucas. I haven't lost a life yet. That's just really good for me. Lucas Lee, Ramona's evil, second evil ex-boyfriend. Mm. Yeah. Take that, Lucas. You're a rock star. That's what I think. Get it? <laughs> mm. 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 Oh, you just got brown. You got dominated. <laughs> Ooh, I got an item. Ooh, what item is this? Hold on. Pick up coins. What item? Hold on. It's a skateboard. Ooh. Do I get to hop on this? Oh, that was so good. That was the best. I don't think I've ever beaten that level that quickly before. Let's see, how many how many coins did I get for playing through that? That's, that's pretty good for not having the subspace highway. 46 coins. Not bad at all. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I can get to level 3. I'm at Leo's palace right now. Okay, I wasn't planning on playing another level because I never played it before. So, otherwise I'm going to play through this entire game without having a chance to play with you guys. Oh wow, you can do halfway through the level? Cross the level in parking lot? I didn't even know that. Okay. Okay, I feel like that's a good stopping point. That's a really short video though. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. That was level 2 of Got Pilgrim vs. The World. I will catch you guys on another video in the future. Uh, bye.